They welcome renowned artists from around the globe and from close to home. Today, I take you inside the Moss Art Center at Virginia Tech to sit down with Executive Director Ruth Walks. That's right, and as Ruth explains, this center is more than just a performance center. It's also creating a thriving creative community that's offering inspiration in a wide variety of forms. I am here at the Moss Art Center on the campus of Virginia Tech, and I'm talking to the executive director, Ruth Walks. Thanks so much for having me out. Oh, thank you for visiting. Yeah, so we're sitting in the theater. Yes, this is the, the Ann and Ellen Center. Fife Theater. Mm -hmm. It is absolutely gorgeous, and I have to say, you've been around for five years, and this is the first time I've been here. That's not shame, good. Shame, shame, shame on, on me. <laughs> absolutely. I'm so sorry, and I'm so disappointed because look at the space. Yes. So yes. tell me about the Moss Art Center. Well, as you mentioned, we opened five years ago here on Virginia Tech's campus in, in Blacksburg. And um, it really, you know, it's just been an extraordinary five years here. I think that the Moss Art Center, our intention is to be serving the, the campus and students and on their learning and really enhancing the university overall. We have audiences who come here for performances from uh, across the region, uh, including students, of course. Mm -hmm. uh, we have exhibitions in our gallery spaces. Um, we have some wonderful spaces as well that support creative technologies and a lot of research that's happening in those areas through our Institute for Creativity, Arts and Technology. Uh, so yes, this is a pretty act active hub and space yeah. for, for all kinds of public engagement and learning and research and experimentation. Wow, all right, so let's yeah. break it all down. So let's okay. start here in the theater. What mm -hmm. kind of performances do you have here? We have we have really the full breadth of genre that happens here on this stage. We have an orchestra shell, so we'll have chamber music concerts that happen in here. We have contemporary dance programs, theater, um, all of those, about 30 or so touring artists that we bring in each season. And then we also support student performance happening in here as well each, each year, each semester. So right. our um, Department of Music, our Department of Theater have opportunities here as well. Yeah, I mean, mm -hmm. what an amazing opportunity to perform on this stage yes. in front of this I, I mean, right. how, how many people does this seat? It's about 1,200 seat audience. Yeah. Wow, mm -hmm. that is incredible. Yeah. yeah. Okay, and then you have, like you said, the galleries. We do. Uh, right now we have a wonderful exhibition upstairs. It's called Swarm. So it's sort of multi-media uh, interpretations of swarming. We have bees, we have butterflies. Downstairs we have a community project uh, that we call Multiply. And this has been one that through, for the past several weeks now, people have come in and been able to put their own little colorful hexagonal sticker on the walls. That's really cool. <laughs> All right, and then you have uh, a space called The Cube. What Correct. happens in there? It is like a black box theater, but it's really, really sort of supercharged with um, you know, 150 speaker audio system in there so we can have spatialized audio, um, sound and experimentation. Uh, we have motion capture in there. So it's used um, often for research. Wow, all right, <laughs> so let's talk about what's coming up. Okay. Because November 30th you have yes. Martha Redbone, right? Martha Redbone, who is an amazing singer, musician. Uh, she blends so many different styles of American music. In January, a group from Montreal called Cirque El Waz, uh, in a really, really very wonderful, fun program. Uh, we, we've had Cirque companies here before, and, and many of them come from Canada. There's such a rich tradition there, mm -hmm. the circus arts. Well, you know, there's so much going on. I mm -hmm. need to sign up for a newsletter or get on okay. your website. We so how do, do we do that yes. if we're interested? Well, it's very easy, probably easiest to visit our website, mm -hmm. and that's www.artcenter.vt.edu. Mm -hmm. uh, and on there you can, you can sign up, set up an account, and you can get on our mailing list and, and be all set. Yeah. It's an incredible place. Yeah. Thank yes, you so thanks. much for having me out. Thank you. Mm -hmm. It's been a pleasure. Beautiful place. I'm yes. telling you what, those pictures don't do it justice. Be sure to visit soon. For tickets to any of the performances Ruth mentioned, head on over to artcenter.vt.edu or call the Moss Art Center box office at 540-231-5300.